Hi guys, it's Yogesh Agarwal here. Today I will show you how to set up Wiki Submitter software step by step. So first step is to download the software. Please go to the members area. Uh, you will be provided with the link, username and password in your email after your purchase. So just go here, login and please download this file wikisubmitter.zip. So once you download this file, it will have a setup file. Just run that and once you complete your setup, you will get a shortcut here, Wiki Submitter in your desktop so you just need to double click it and uh, after that you will get this screen login screen here you can use the same username and password which you use to log into members area and for serial key uh, in members area you can find it here or else you'll be getting in an email your serial key in a separate email so you can use this information to log in just click on login it will automatically validate your license can username and password and it will log in so yeah so the first and very basic step is to configure your dcaptcha account in this wiki submitter software so please go to app settings click on captcha settings and first step is to select dcaptcha from this drop down click on save now you can use your dcaptcha account login information so this is my dcaptcha account login information just enter it click on save and click on check balance it will show you your account balance so now we have completed our basic setup let me start with adding a project and running it first click on new project button here this Let's type my first project click on save now it will add a project but an empty project now you need to enter all the details now here you can enter your article uh, followed by hash links let me enter it this is my sample article about living life and after entering your article you need to use token this is the token hash links open braces one close braces hash link this is very very important without this article will not post now here we are adding this token because it will create a hyperlink based on platform as not all wiki sites support html syntax it will just take one link from here and an anchor from here and it will create a hyperlink and it will embed in article when it is going to submit so this is all about article and yeah one more thing is that you can spin the article to generate unique variation of article so that each and every website will have a different article so just click on spin article it will automatically create spin tag so for each and every submission it will take one word from each phrase so that it will give a unique variation of article so this is it this is very simple that's it we just need to add an article add this token that's it you are done for this section in your website in this section enter your website you just need to enter your own website that is mywebsite.com here you can enter all your own websites and uh, here you can enter your anchor text that is my website my website to and you can enter whatever you want or any keywords for which you want to rank let's say if you want to rank for dog training you can put it here dog training dogs training then denver or like all all the keywords or combination of things whatever you want you can put it here and here for wiki sites in this section you need to browse and enter wiki sites in this section you need to browse and enter wiki sites you can use a list from members area that is uh, this list okay and uh, just for demonstration i'll be using my own personal list so this is the list so, it is saved now you need to configure an email id and password uh, remember this email id and password will be used to register a website in wiki sites so please don't use your personal email email ids or password just use a spare one so i have one here i'm just copying and pasting it here 
and click on verify email it will just log in into this email id and check so after this step you can just skip this step it will just send the reports to your email id if you want you can configure or else you can skip this one and uh, and next step is to configure the total threads so based on your version you can configure threads uh, right now i have a full version ultimate pack so i can use un unlimited number of threads so i am just uh, using 96 threads uh, and uh, this is about thread configuration now final step is to select the operation that you want to do i will be clicking register account verify email and update the passwords and then post article so after selecting this day i'll just click on start work and uh, i'll get a dialog box okay now you can see the total success failed here or else you can go to scheduler jobs it will show you currently what it is working on and what is the total numbers of site and what is the success and failure and in task logs you can see the live status of what each and every thread is doing so guys this is all about wiki submitter if you have any doubts please don't hesitate to contact our support thank you guys